Tonight, new revelations about Brian Williams and his ambitions for the future. He apparently wanted to be a comic host and even leave NBC to do it. CBS 2's Dick Brennan is here now with this new information. Dick? Yeah, lots of new information. The revelations say the network NBC is rife with infighting. It comes from a story in New York Magazine, and the author of the article described a troubled state of affairs at NBC. Chaos is what's going on over there. I mean, this is a this is a news network in meltdown. And at the center of the storm, Brian Williams suspended for telling tall tales about his war coverage. Now, a New York Magazine article by Gabriel Sherman says before the scandal, Williams had tired of just reading the teleprompter and wanted to go Hollywood. This is a story of a man who wanted to get out of news. He wanted to move into the world of late night comedy. He tried to take over Jay Leno's job. He actually tried to take over David Letterman's job. And when those opportunities didn't pan out, he he really was at a crossroads in his career. And Williams apparently had little support with NBC staffers when he found himself in trouble. Among them, the senior statesman of Nightly News, Tom Brokaw, whom Sherman says had a frosty relationship with his successor. Brian Williams really felt uh, expressed pressure to live up to, to Brokaw's legacy, and he told Chuck Todd, shortly after Chuck Todd became moderator of Meet the Press, at least your ghost is dead, mine still walks the building. And Brokaw still has an office at NBC, he hasn't really left. Staffers were said to be upset with Williams' approach to Nightly News, which meant that he didn't want anything divisive on the program, no matter how newsworthy. NBC News is known for their investigative reporting. They did some really tough stories on Obamacare and whether the White House knew if people would lose their policies. And Brian Williams did not want that story on Nightly News. So where does Brian Williams and Nightly News go from here? So far, the ratings have held with Lester Holt in the anchor chair. How are they going to take a guy off the air who has stepped into this role, done well, and then say, oh, after six months, you know what, you know, we're going to bring back the disgraced anchor who has caused us so much trouble. But Williams is said to be strategizing to get his job back and repair his reputation. In the meantime, though, he apparently grant, cannot grant any interviews until his suspension is up in six months. And that is a long time in television and elsewhere. It is. Yes. Okay, Dick. Dick, thank you. Well.